this Lazarus today I will talk about only Luikal so let's just start Luikal comes with a team skill that gives all non-Japanese players 15% and a hotline with Tsubasa and Rival so when he receives a pass from Tsubasa or Rival his stats will rise by 30% when he will select the next command his special skills are snap jumping volley with 450 momentum bullet <laughs> shoot with 370 a ranked smashing header with 340 and a ranked swift interception with 295 hidden skills are bond with three or more agility type club players that gives everyone three percent skill block cancels so he will cancel up to two special skill blocks used against him and recovery by 50 percent so Bond is pretty easy to accomplish, that's great. Skill block cancel is excellent because he is, you know, when it one dimensional player. When you pass the ball to him, you want him to score, so that's excellent too. And recovery 50%. So if he doesn't manage to score or if he loses the ball, he will not sleep in the offside for 10 minutes, so that's great too. Uh, when we look at his stats, uh, when not receiving a pass from Tsubasa or Rivaul, he is a very bad dribbler at 22.9k, uh, terrible ground shooter at 48.5, uh, volley is bad too at 59k, header is good at 77.8, so that's not when uh, receiving a pass from uh, Tsubasa and Rivaul, his pass is uh, bad at 31.1 and Swift Interception A ranked is at 25.9 so that's not very impressive too. When he receives a pass from Tsubasa or Rivaul, he is still a bad dribbler at 29.8, he's a bad ground shooter at 63 Okay, uh, when he receives a better shot, he'll be excellent there. Uh, volley is good at 76.7. Header is extremely toxic at 101k. Uh, pass is now good at 40k with precise pass errand. So basically, when he receives a better ground shoot and a better pass as ranked, he will be very, very usable right now not so much uh interception sucks because you know when he receives a pass from Tsubasa on Revol, he will not be able to do interceptions or tackles so that's not uh, uh buffed by 30 percent there uh basically this guy is straightforward you know uh you want to pass the ball with Tsubasa Revol and hope that it's a high ball because he doesn't have a high ball request i personally don't don't like this guy at this state no uh when when he receives a better pass and let's say it's a 370 momentum that's precise pass s strength right when he receives a pass from uh tsubasa on revolt he will be 60k passer so that's you know great if the pass let's say is for 30 momentum 70k pass that's ridiculously good if he let's say gets a better dribble you know 420 46 that would still suck so uh yeah uh you know if he even receives a pass let's say from Tsubasa and Revol that is a low ball when he gets a better special skill pass he can even uh you know uh bully someone and pass over good interceptors with that club said that they want you to play him with let's say Espadas who has high ball assigned to to other players so when Tsubasa or Rivaul passes to him that it's always a high ball but that way you are uh, using uh, Espadas who is not very good it's it's just a lot of work for a player that is you know that has a better better alternatives right now of course if he receives a high ball from Tsubasa and Revol, he will be able to score on anybody, even Zeno, because he is just so powerful there. Uh, Zeno has a forward and, you know, air shoot killer passives, but this 101k is extremely ridiculous. Plus, he has color advantage versus him, against him, so let's say he gets a better ground shoot, you know. 
that will be same as volley 76 so that's excellent you need a high baller if you have a high baller excellent you know I wouldn't uh, suggest you to pull for him because there's better alternatives in this uh, meta right now but you know if you got him great you know just to wait a couple of months I guess for those skills I hope that uh, you will not have to wait enough and uh, yeah if you wanna pull for this guy good luck if you don't yeah great if you like this video like it if you didn't like it fuck it uh, all the social media stuff are in the description of the video below I stream Mondays Fridays on YouTube every other day will be on Twitch only exclusively on Twitch uh, probably soon I will switch only to Twitch <laughs> I'll switch only to Twitch uh, I will tell you guys when that happens but right now it's YouTube Mondays and Fridays because I have difficulties with uh, YouTube servers uh, multi-streaming services so yeah that's basically it see you guys bye